How y'all are tonight? That's our Louisiana way of saying welcome. <laughs> right? Okay, tonight, what I'd like to do tonight is say congratulations for being here. Okay? Because it's one of those check marks that you're doing what it takes to learn and be a part of your success. That's one of those things. 10 hours a week, and you have your job description. Tonight we're going to review, and you can use this video as a follow-up video to your prospects or to people you've shown the business to, not in the business. You can use it in many different ways because we're going to go through a quick summary of all the benefits of, of being in 7K and what it means to one to be in 7K, okay? 7K medals. And so we're going to start off real quick, real fast, with how do you talk to people? Because a lot of people don't want to talk to people. Well, you can email, you can text, and you can do. You pick a one-liner, one sentence that you like to use and that you're comfortable with just to pique a person's interest. And you can use... A multiple of them and in your associate training and all my trainings that I've given you I've given you several different little prospecting lines now I use a multiple of them at different K times I like to have about five that I use and one of the ones I really like to use because most people need extra money and so that's what I you know if if there was a way that you could earn an extra thousand dollars a month or even a thousand dollars a week and then it could turn into seven thousand a week would you take 15 minutes to look at some information to see what it's like see what it's about real simple they say yes and i'll give them a card so go to that website right there watch the video and here's all my contact information Give it back. You can use that same thing in an email. You can use that same thing in a text. Now, with a person, it's a real touch. Because why? I know that they heard what I said. And I gave them a card, right? In a text or an email, you do not know if they've read that. It may have went into their inbox, along with the other thousand emails that they got, if they're like me. They get a hundred or to a thousand a day. Okay. I've got eight email accounts, and my wife has seen it sometimes. I got sixty thousand emails in one. Unread. <laughs> Guess what? I don't have time to read sixty thousand. I don't have time to read a thousand. You know, if it took you thirty seconds just to look at the subject of the email, glance quick. And I'm a pretty good speed reader now. Do you know how much time of your day you've lost? <laughs> so nobody does that. So you may have to send that email 30 times before you have a high probability that they read it, okay? And you don't know if they clicked on it or not for to watch the videos, right? So absolutely the best way to do the touch, the reach, the peak in a person's interest is personally on the phone or eyeball to eyeball. But you can do it on the phone. And then by doing it on the phone, same thing, you tell them, I'm going to text you a link or I'm going to send you, email you a link. And then you get to do what? Find out what their contact information is. And you add it to your list because that gives you follow-up capability. Correct? Okay, now follow-up is important. And we've got a lot of tools that we can follow up, but it's always best to follow up with tools, right? Either our, our short four-minute auto, auto overlay clip by David, uh, the travel benefits. Being a member gets you free travel benefits, right? Get the Book travel at wholesale cost. And if you 
if you just join just as a member, you get 250 travel dollars to discount off of those travel, those hotel travel costs. Now you can't, you might be able to apply all $250 on one event, but not necessarily. And you'll never get total free travel, but you will get a discount off of the discount. <laughs> so that's really powerful. It's money in the pocket, right? Travel savings is money in the pocket. Booking at wholesale at below any of the any of the places you can book online through any of the other things, Travelocity, Priceline, you name it, Kayak, you can always book cheaper through your 7K gate, uh, getaway site. Because why? That's the wholesale site that they all use. Bingo. And they always have a markup over it. So that's why you can see a little price difference. So travel benefits, meaning less cost to the members. And how much did that travel cost us being a member of that? No, it was free. All we had to do is what? Punch in our travel dollars, put them into the program, and then, then if we use them all, we, we, we've used them all, we can still go there anytime and book our travel. So we can also give these things as what? Gifts. Hey, you ever thinking real hard of a good Christmas gift to give? They don't have to be members of 7K. But by giving a gift, you also are using a marketing tool to introduce them to some of the benefits of 7K. And if they like what they experience, they'll continue using the travel site, but once they're out of travel dollars, they don't get any extra discounts, right? Okay, so that's also a very good recruiting technique. It's a little slower, that process, gifting, but it, it works, okay? And so... We talk peak in interest. Now, why are we doing the business? Well, there's tax benefits. Even if you're on a retirement income, Social Security, how many of you like to pay taxes on the money you've already paid taxes on for 40 years? So if you earn more than married, married, filing jointly, filing jointly, 22,000. 38000 huh? Oh, okay, 38. 38.5 or something like that. Well, anyway, if you earn more through your interest savings, through your other things, you end up and you've got a total taxable income of more than whatever the new rules are, you're going to end up paying a tax on the money you paid taxes on all your working life. Now, that's a revolting development, isn't it? <coughs> And so who likes to pay tax on the money that we already pay taxes on? So introduce the tax benefits, and you don't have to do it because the CPAs do it. They'll, they'll confirm it. It's called a home-based business tax benefit. And, you know, just learn to ask the question. I like to ask people, do you like giving the government extra money that they can waste of yours? Me, I don't like to give the government any more than they deserve. And so if you're using all the tax laws properly, you get the same tax deductions as the big, giant corporations like GE, BASF, Ethel, all these big corporations, Google. Apple, Google. You get the same tax deductions in your small business. So you can turn what was personal expenses into business-related expenses. That becomes deductions. You get to deduct it from your taxable income, reduces your tax burden. So just with a home-based business tax benefit, if you're meeting the criteria, so you want to definitely talk to a CPA, but they're pretty easy, and we'll give you an article. If you're in our organization, we'll refer you to an article and we can even refer you to some CPAs in our business that will share that information with you. 
you know. Uh, but that's a huge benefit. Now, I put together a little analysis that shows just your travel dollars makes your whole membership and buying your corn of the month free. So how about being in business for two years, collecting 12, 24 silver coins and getting travel savings the whole time of that two years for the vacations, business trip, whatever you're going to do with that travel when you travel. As you're learning to do this business. Okay? That's a pretty powerful program, isn't it? I mean, just kind of think about that. Now, if you're working, you got an income, or you own retirement, and you're on Social Security, and you got a retirement income, and your income is above those minimum limits, you need more tax deductions anyway, so you should be in a part-time business that is going to be fun and increases your wealth and increases your ability to earn income. Okay? And why not turn... I never go on vacations. I don't know about y'all. I never go on a vacation. I go on a business trip. Now, I'm going to tell you because, you know, I've, I haven't heard it properly presented by anyone yet. And I've been holding this for a long time. But I did teach it many years ago when I made the millions. And only the people who attended my training sessions, because they didn't have videos, got to hear. The number one way that all of your trips become a business expense, I'm going to share that with you tonight. So how many in this room think if you travel to Montana or to Texas, or, you know, Dallas, or Houston, or New York, or one of these regional events. Or you just have, you have a friend. They're in 7K. And you travel over there. And you meet with them. I'm, and, and you're going to stay a while with them. Okay? How many of you think that is a business trip? Our CPA's got this one right. And so it's part of the link of what's doing this. It's called common occupation meetings. Anytime you're meeting a person in a common <coughs> occupation and you go there and you do things and you discuss your occupation, your business or occupation, that's a business trip. Okay? That's the main thing. Now, to Make it 100% tax deductible. You only need to do one thing. Prior to making the meeting trip, send an email. That I'm going to come talk to you about our 7K business. On such and such time to such and such time, are you available? That's it. Print out your email, stick it in your tax documents. That's it. <laughs> You need no further documentation. Okay? That's the number one thing you need. You have a business trip intended, and that's the reason you're going, and you planned it ahead of time. Now, I don't care what else you do, and don't tell anybody else whatever you did during the time you were there, other than I met with a person, we talked about 7K, and we just enjoyed our time together about our business. That's all you ever have to say. Okay? Now, don't let any tax advisor tell you your business meals are not tax deductible. Because all small business meals are tax deductible just like big business meals are. 50% of them are tax deductible. You don't even have to pay for the other person's bill anymore. You can pay for yours. It's called Dutch Treat. They can pay for theirs. You can pay for yours. 50% of your meal, tax deductible. Only time you need a receipt at now is when it's $75 or more. All you need to do is make a notation 
I like using this. This is the most beautiful note keeper for taxes that you've ever seen in your life. <laughs> okay? Put it on a date in your calendar. Put it who, who you met with, where you ate at, how much it cost, and what you discuss. 7K medals. <laughs> Bingo. That's all you need to do, especially if they're in 7K medals. If they're not in 7K medals, you're talking about, I talked to them about joining 7K medals. Bingo. Simple record, record keeping. Now, why did I say, why did I give you these few tips? Well, because that's the benefit of being in 7K in a home-based business. Now, this applies to Mary Kay, Amway, Shackley, Juice Plus, many other network marketing companies. Same thing applies because it's a home-based business. But it applies to 7K Metals. <laughs> now, let me ask you something. Just by meeting the requirements of trying to make a profit. So you don't have to make a profit, but you have to be trying to make a profit. Okay? Now, to make a profit in 7K Metals, what do you have to do? You have to be active, because you can't earn a check unless you're what? Active. active. So that means you need to do what? Either sponsor a person once a month, or you have to be doing what? You have to be buying a coin of the month, 20 points, right? Every month to be active. That's meeting a business criteria, right? Okay, now. Buying a coin of the month, and let's just round off figures, you know, $104. Let's round it up. And if you pay you $250, $249 membership, you get your $250 travel card. And you bought a coin every month <coughs> for 12 months, had made a check, and you try to pay pizza's interest. You sent some emails, you sent some texts, you got a record of your phone calls, okay? You're trying to make a profit, okay? Now, those personal expenses of at least 5000 and every CPA will tell you that you can easily write off at least $5,000 in personal expenses that are now business expenses because your cell phone, you didn't, to send that text, you had to have what? Cell phone. <laughs> okay. To check your business of your 7K medals and to watch videos, you had to have a what? Computer, iPad, <laughs> laptop. You had to have, and you had to have internet service, right? Whoa, man, look at all these expenses starting to rack up. Now, you're going to have those expenses anyway, so why not make them business expenses? Do we see what I'm talking about? Okay. So, with that, your business is free. Your coins are free. Paid for by the taxes you would have paid the U.S. government to waste for you. Or you invested into who? Yourself. Hello. <laughs> Big, huge benefit. So when you add the travel benefits, the tax benefits, if one really understands this, they're going to do 7K. The problem is they didn't hear you. Show them this video, please, and give them the two pieces of paper, <laughs> okay? Because they may not hear you, but watching the video, shh, I think you're going to hear me, okay? <laughs> and then you can check it all out. You didn't even call me. They have my number, okay? Now, the other benefit, the other real, the most significant benefit about being a member of 7K is we're buying products of value. Not only are we buying a product of value because we have past history to look at, because if we'd have bought one of these every month since 1986 when they've been producing them, we'd have spent about $30,000, and we'd have a collection worth anywhere between $1.2 million and $1.7 and that's verifiable. 
Is it the only reason it's between 1.2 million and 1.7 million? Is it, it depends on how fast you want to sell it. Okay? You want to sell it fast, you're closer to 1.2 million. You want to take your time and get the most for it, it can be closer to 1.7 million to get your value. Okay? So, eh, is it true that maybe in the next 30 years, if we sell these, our collection or our future members' collection would be worth 1.2 million in future dollars like these were? No guarantee. But is there any guarantee that your stock investments, your joint, your your mutual funds are going to give the same performance they did in the last 30 years? But, you know, you can lose everything in those stock investments, can't you? Guess what you can't lose in this? Can't lose everything. You always have a product of value regardless if it's just the value of silver. Okay? So that's the least. So your choice, your choice, ladies and gentlemen, pills, lotions, potions, go juice, weight loss pills, you name it, energy drinks, are real money. <laughs> that's the real biff difference. Okay? Now, our membership is like Costco or like Amazon Prime. You pay a membership fee and you get benefits. What's our benefits in 7K Metals? Our benefits in 7K Metals is not only that we can get unique collectible coins that the company decides through their relationship with mints around the world to buy and to make a significant difference for us in our future and our family's future by making those proper decisions and buying off of large contracts from mints. In fact, some of the MS-70s they get in a variety of coins, they buy everything that's made. So if you know anything about the numismatic world, guess what? If any collector ever wants one of those MS-70s to add to their collection, who can they get it from? Okay. Only from a 7K meddler. <laughs> you got to be a member. <laughs> okay. Now, here's the real benefit. Okay, here's the real benefit. You get to buy silver and gold bullion at cost. Dealer cost. Nowhere else in America, at any time in America, has the average person been able to buy and collect and save silver bullion at cost. So you have a huge savings program possibility. Now, everybody, you know, 90 Almost 98% of Americans do not own any gold and silver. Not any. It's because they have been not, they have not been educated about the true value of gold and silver over time. Now, they know all about this fiat currency called dollars. Right? Paper. Now, one of our jobs in 7K is to help educate our friends, relatives, business associates, and people. And you let them know, you know, I'm not trying to get you into anything. I'm not trying to get you to join what I'm doing. I'm not, I'm not trying to do that. I'm trying to give you some information. Information you know nothing about. And if you do, you don't know enough detail. And so information is free, except for you, the time it takes for you to look at it. And this company made it available in very short 
succinct terms so you don't have to go spending months and years learning about the gold and silver market. And we got a little pamphlet. If you'll take the time to really watch a nine-minute video about fiat currency and read through this and ask me any questions you want, but this one page explains it all. Because that's what you've been taught to save. So that the world and the governments and the banks can take advantage of you. That's it. Just look at the value of what a dollar could buy in the same terms over time. And you get out to where we at at 2018. And the value of a dollar isn't worth a nickel. And let's illustrate that. Here we go. 19, just as, not so far back, but just 1965. That one dollar, one ounce silver piece was worth one dollar bill. You took 2,500 of those or 2,500 of those and you bought a brand new fastback Mustang. Fast forward to today, what were 2,500 of those that you saved, kept in the bank, what would that buy you? What kind of car? <clears throat> a car hardly get up the hill car. Won't even buy you wheels and hubcaps on most cars today. But if you had those 2,500 ounces of silver that you saved over the years, one coin at a time, what kind of car could you buy today? 2,500 ounces of silver. Two brand new Mustangs. Hello! It maintains its relative value to this fiat currency. So it kind of smooths out inflation, stock market changes, deflation, all these things. This little thing, silver, in a very tradable form, Smooths all that out. That that really is the language. That that's all you need to know. It smooths it out. And we'll give you a further verification of that because we'll take go back a little bit further. 1870s. $20 gold piece. You know why they call it a $20 gold piece? Because they started printing up these things back then. Called $20 bill. <laughs> And so you could get a $20 bill bill if you traded them a $20 gold piece. That $20 gold piece was one ounce of gold. Okay, so in the 1870s with a $20 bill or one ounce gold piece, you could buy a brand new coat, revolver, or a custom-made suit. Fast forward to today. What can you buy with that $20 bill you saved? Can't even buy a shirt on sale at Walmart. <laughs> now, what can you buy with that one ounce gold piece that you saved? You can buy your custom made suit or two suits or two high end revolvers. Hello. Now, so we're trying to share with you that you don't have to save everything in gold and silver, but you really need to do what wealthy people are doing. They maintain 10 to 15% of their total net worth in gold and silver. So if you were, have that as a goal, 7K Metals gives you that opportunity to buy your gold and silver, accumulate a piece at a time at an affordable cost that you can afford powerful. That's all we're trying to do is help you understand that. The person that presented this to you, that's all they're trying to do. So, you know, get our preconceived thoughts out of our head. Wash our brains. Just have an open mind and start evaluating the information. You know, our mind works like a parachute whole bunch better when that sucker's open <laughs> than when it's absolutely closed off, preconceived, know everything already, 
when you really don't. Okay? Now, let me kind of share with you some of the greater benefits. Because if you really approach this as a business, and if you really, if you really ever dreamed about the possibility of working at home, out of your home, everywhere you travel is part of business, and you could have total time, freedom, and wealth. And what I mean by that, just think about this statement. If you made $7,000 a week, and no matter what you did today, next week you're going to have a $7,000 check come in. And the week after that, you're going to have a $7,000 check in. What do you think your life would be like financially? It's time you turned your dream machine on. Don't let the world beat you down and tell you you can't do things. Because you don't have to have a master's in business like I do. You don't have to have a chemical engineering degree like I do. Because I didn't become free and independent through that education and through making tons of money in the corporate world. And in fact, I was still almost dead broke when I got out of it. I, I, I wasn't dead broke, but I had about $250,000. That's not a lot. And I, I also didn't own my home. <laughs> Do you ever want to be one of those? Network marketing. Network marketing is a proven industry that has created millionaires ever since the industry was invented and brought into the present because it's a home-based business. Now, of course, there have been network marketing companies that have been scams, pyramid deals. Pyramid deals, they don't have real products. They don't have a real opportunity like the airplane business, the train business. I mean, it's kind of chain letter kind of stuff. They don't have something real. I mean, that's kind of obvious. And, yeah, I started off with a network marketing company that I thought I could become one of these because of all the people I saw that were making $200,000, $300,000 a month. 50000 a week. I saw their checks. I saw where they lived. I knew it was real. And they were cops, broke preachers, <laughs> carpenters. They came from all walks of life. None of them had the education I had. None. And I thought to myself, oh man, these people can do it. I know I can. Guess what? None of that counts in network marketing. I had to learn how to do network marketing. You're going to have to learn to do network marketing. Everybody has to learn. Okay? I wasn't a chemical engineer the day I enrolled and went to my first class. It took me five hard, long years. And I didn't earn a penny during that time. Get my MBA took me two more long, hard years. And I didn't earn a penny during that time. In fact, I got in a lot of debt because we were poor. And my wife had to work for us just to eat and pay rent while I was going to school. Okay? But I got in network marketing, and along came a company with gold coins with a binary plan. And I said, I'm going to take a chance. I'm going to do this sucker. Because this thing's a no-brainer. Everybody needs to own some gold and silver. And I became totally debt-free and earned millions. But it's not what I earned. To succeed in that business, I had to literally help Thousands of people earn money. And Woodrow, a friend of mine, he's in the business with us at 7K here in Baton Rouge. George, in the business with us here in 7K. 
they know how much money I make. They know how much money they made. And they know that it wasn't the company. I put on a leaders conference that I paid for out of my pocket, rented the building, paid for the meals, bought all the awards that I handed out to more than 300 of my leaders, and every one of them made more than $75,000 in that business. I had two people in my business that made over $750,000 in a year. I had eight that made over half a million in a year. I had over 2,000 that made over $50,000 part-time. Now, it wasn't that I did that. We as a team did that. So if you ever wanted to be a part of a team, the binary plan forces you to do teamwork. And I'm going to show you on the board what I mean by that so that you really understand the benefits here. And it's a people of a business of people helping people. But you've got to be willing to learn. See, that was the one thing I was willing to learn how. I just had, I knew it could be done because I did all my research. I knew it could be done in other companies. And so I had this burning desire to succeed no matter what. No matter how many times I failed, I was going to get up and do it again. Now, some of you may be young enough that you want to do that too. And I encourage you to do it because you can. You don't have to have all that education. You don't have to have to do anything. This company and the leaders in this company will teach you all the skills, attitudes, and techniques that you need to have. You've got to have the willingness to learn. And I've developed it into a real short system. It's called a job description. That's how I built that organization of over 70,000 people. Okay? And there it is. Five little things that you need to do. But the first one starts out with 10 hours of commitment out of your life. For two years. One year to learn. One year to earn. And then three to five years to build, build a huge business. After those two years. Okay, so it's how big of a foundation you can put in place during those two years. That's the whole key. But if you're not willing to learn, you're not willing to show up for class, you're never going to get it. You're never going to catch everything you need to do. Everybody here tonight typically shows up for class every, every time. You know, you know, people get sick. People have to, and we understand that. I mean, I didn't have perfect attendance in college either, you know. But the key is you don't make a habit out of missing. That's the key. Okay, so real quick review of those, those things. So it's a five to ten hour commitment out of your life. And what do you do in that? Well, you got to make a list of people. That's number one. But you got to help. This thing is full of your contacts. Dump it mean put it in a written record, okay? Because you're going to build on that the entire two years. You're going to work on that one day a week at least, at a minimum. It's better if you work on it three times for about 10 to 15 minutes, 20 minutes. As long as you're writing down names and contacts, you just keep working at it when you're working at it. If you got, and you're doing that kind of stuff, stop. Because you aren't going to write another name. I know what it's like to have mind block. Okay? And so everybody gets it. The whole key is, that's a very important thing. And I know it's so easy. And these things appear to be so easy that I'm showing you. That's the real trick in network marketing. It's so easy that everybody doesn't do it. That's the fact. 
everybody skips the most important step, making your list. Because, see, I'm going to have you contact those 500 people in that next three to five years. The whole time you're doing this business, you're going to rapidly go through this list real quick with that peak interest, remember? Because all you need is two partners, one on your left, one on your right. That's the first step. Get you two partners, okay? Some of you do it in a day. Some it may take you a month. Some it may take you six months. Some it may take you a year. That's okay. Some it may take you two years. That's okay too. You still can do this, okay? And you're gonna make money. You, you're not gonna be losing any money. And you're going to be learning a lot of skills, attitudes, and technique that help you in all walks of life. Okay? So, what's the next thing you need to be doing? Well, you need to go through your trainings. Okay? One hour a week, you spend on training. You got your associate training in your background. You got all my YouTube trainings up on my channel on the YouTube. You got plenty of trainings to get done. You do it on your own time. And you, you schedule it yourself. But you do one hour training. You do one hour of meeting like we're meeting here tonight, okay? Business association, okay? And you do five contacts a day, five days a week. Now, if that's too much for you, that's those touches. That's that peak in interest. Now, if you do meeting with a person one-on-one, -on -one, you actually show them the opportunity with the videos, or you sit down and watch this video, then that counts for the five. One of those is worth the five touches. <laughs> and so if five is too much for you, just do two a day. Where you're passing out, meeting with a person, passing out two of these cards to two people you talk to, that would take the card. That's all. And you, you go through everybody you know like that. Okay? And that's part of your learning. And passing out those cards are what I call the IPAs, the income producing activities. So you hear me talk a lot about SATs, skills, attitudes, and techniques, IPAs, income producing activities. Now, you know what makes the difference between the successful people and the unsuccessful people in network marketing, or really it's in any entrepreneurial business, any entrepreneurial aspect. Now, I pull these out of the Bible, and I think that's a great success book to read, by the way. So if you spend 15 minutes of your day, five days a week in the Bible, you're going to find all these success principles, trust me. And one of them is patience. So any of you that do our study of the Bible, you know what I'm talking about when you hear the word patience, okay? But you're going to have to have patience with yourself because you're going to want to make this happen now. And you're going to want people to help you. And you want to want people to help you make money. Well, the training is for all that. And the teamwork is for all that. What you got to do is learn how to use it. Learn how to employ those skills. That's the patience. The next one is the one I like. It's perseverance. Abraham Lincoln taught us a lot about perseverance. One day I'll give you all my little Abraham Lincoln training. Okay. But you talk about a guy that persevered. You don't know how many times he lost political races in his career, <laughs> and he became president of the United States, if you really learn his story. But you got to persevere through things. you got to persevere through change. you got to persevere through, you know, negative consequences. you got to persevere, you know, when a company gets attacked. And believe me, if it's going to start taking big business away from other network marketing companies, believe me, it's going to get attacked. you got to persevere through all that, okay? Especially if you want to make the big money. And you got to be persistent. That's why I tell you, you're going to contact your contacts how many times? 
Seven. But you don't contact them seven times in a row in the same month. You got to go through all your contacts before you come back around to that one. And you never beg a person to get in this business. You present the opportunity. You encourage them to have their mind open. And you encourage them to get enough information to make an informed business decision. That's what you that's what you pressure them on is getting enough information to make an informed business decision. Because really, like I said, if your mind's open, you're going to get in this business. I mean, everybody should. I see no logical reason anybody should not get in this business unless they're president of another network marketing company. <laughs> now, prospecting. And I had some people challenge me one time on that. I don't know. What do you mean, prospecting in the Bible? You ever heard of the Great Commission? <laughs> it is so full in the Bible, it's amazing. But anyway, you're going to have to learn how to prospect. That means how to share. How to, how to share, not intimidate. There's a difference. Sharing and intimidation is two different things. Sharing and begging is two different things. You, you're going to have to learn to share. And you only learn by what? Like Thomas Edison did. Like Bob Reed did. Failing. <laughs> by making mistakes. By making yourself feel foolish. Yeah, that's true. But what's $7,000 a week for the rest of your life worth? <laughs> I didn't mind feeling foolish as I was learning. <laughs> it's the same thing when a teacher puts you on the spot with a question and you didn't read the homework assignment. Mm. <laughs> That's the same feeling. <laughs> I know what that is. But then you're going to, by doing this, you're going to develop posture. Posture means you have true belief. What's the difference between a Christian and an agnostic? Posture. Christian knows they're going to heaven. Only the People who think they're good think they're going to heaven. Because <laughs> that had nothing to do with it. <laughs> so when I tell you the Bible is one of the greatest leadership books that there is, it is. In fact, out of all the leadership books I've read, and I've read just about every one of them, you know, the old Og Bandinos, the Maxwells, the Jim Rohns, the Tony Robbins, the, you name them. I've read them. Because why? I had a thirst to succeed and to learn how. Okay? I wanted time, freedom, wealth. I wanted to be with my family instead of working all the time, my wasting my life away and not having any affiliation with my family. Priority. So I put a priority on that learning. What are you putting a priority on? Okay? And if you put a priority on God, your family, and your business, you got your priority right. And think about when you have time, freedom, wealth, you can really get that in the right perspective, can't you? Hmm. And that brings you to prosperity. And that is definitely all throughout the Bible. So don't even, don't even go there. And if you can't find it, come on, bring your Bible one day, and we'll go through what I call the seven P's of success. Okay? Now, I'm going to quickly go through that little plan that I was talking about so you can see the real benefits. There you are. There's that counter. Okay? And you have a business with your membership. Your job is to get a person on your left and a person on your right. Correct? Yeah. That's your job. That is your people. Okay? And then your job is to help those people do the same thing. It's called duplication. But you got a team because you're going to be on somebody's left or right. And so let's say you're on somebody's left. Now, you may get what I call gifts from above, and that may happen before you get somebody or after you get somebody. But as long as you're active, 
It doesn't matter if it comes before or after, you're going to get 100 points in your counter. So right now you got 200, and here you got 100. Okay? Now, we're going to say this person got one, okay? And the black's going to be gifts from a below, okay? Because the person you sponsored got that person, okay? Real, real cool. So you get gifts from above, gifts from below. That means you don't have to do all these numbers that I'm going to be talking about. So in the business of network marketing, duplication, growing any business, it works over time. Now you can do this. I'm going to do 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Now this can be days. This can be months. It can be years. It doesn't matter. And that's what I want you to see for the long-term benefit of being in a business like 7K Metals. Okay? I did these things in days. Literally in days. Just about. Up to about right there. Then it slowed down. Because I've happened so many people. <laughs> okay? But, here's the key. you got two people on your left and two people on your right. That could be after two days, after two weeks, after two months. But you got four people in your team. That's two on your left, two on your right. So, if everybody's just half as good as you, they only get one each, right? In your business. In your business, on your team. And that counts for people putting people under you and your people getting people. That goes up and goes up to you. So just kind of think about this. If those two people just go in, you're going to have eight the next day or the next week or the next month. And you're going to have 16 in your business. Then you're going to have 32. Then you have 64. You have 128, 100. 256, 512, 1024, 2048, 4096. So let's just make numbers pretty easy. And let's say there is 2,048 people on your left side. And let's round it down to 2,000. Okay? That makes numbers easy to understand. And 2,000 on your right side. Okay? Let's say that's 12 years. That it took that to happen. Have a little patience. What does that mean to you, though, financially? Over that 12-year period, you know, you have 100 points times that. You have 200,000 points that went up in that counter. Correct? Over that 12-year period. Okay? At $500 a cycle... How much money do you make? You take and you divide 500 into that 200,000. Those zeros goes away like that. And you put a four there and you made what? $4,000. Right? Isn't that right? That's right. You made $4,000 over that 12-year period of time. Just on people joining your business and you only sponsored two that stayed active. Okay? What if you sponsored more? That's just on the membership. Isn't that right? Well, you got 2,000 people on your left and 2,000 people on your right buying a coin every month. So how many points do you have coming up in coins every month? 40,000 points. Right? Mm -hmm. 40,000 points? A month? There's four weeks in a month, right? right. That's 10,000 points per month, right? Per week. Per week. Yeah. Per week. And 500 to go into that, how much? 20. 20 times. 20 cycles. <clears throat> See, none of you caught me in my math error. I was waiting for somebody to catch it. 
Okay? So 20 times 500 is what? $10,000. You made $10,000. Here's the math error, y'all. And I wait for somebody to catch me. You're going to cycle 400 times in that 12-year period. That's what you're going to make in that 12-year period is $200,000. See, most people think this way, the first way I just presented it to you, which is wrong. But that's how they do their math. Unfortunately, we don't teach math real well anymore in America, okay? That means 400 cycles, and then 400 times that is 200,000. So whatever those points are, that's the amount of money you can make. Whatever points you have in that strong side, that's money in the bank. That amount is money in the bank waiting to you to get an equal amount or 500 at a time, so you can pull it out and put it in your pocket, okay? And you can buy coins. So, basically, over that 12-year period, 12-month period, I don't care what period it is. It all still works the same way. And you made $200,000. How many could use an extra $10,000 a year? And... $10,000 a week? Well, you can't make $10,000 a week, so what are you going to make? $7,000. If you're what? Gold. You can't make it if you just sponsor one person here and one person there. The most you can make is what? $500 a week. How do you become? You rank up. You'll learn how to do that, but you essentially do the same thing and you help other people rank up. And that is the business of people helping people in this business. Okay, that's the long-term view, okay? The short-term view, you get in here and you do that in 12 months. You start making 100 grand a year. We have a business partner that's already done that. Her name is Dana Nelson, okay? She's made over 100 grand in this business. Y'all have seen it? It's been posted on Facebook, right? She's our business partner, okay? You're in her business, I'm in her business, and she's made over 100 grand in the business. And she's full-time realtor. Powerful. We haven't even begun to grow. But here's the other great thing about it, okay? Because you're buying... Oh, let me just show you the downside. Let's say your organization, over three years, five years, only gets 25 customers on the left or right. That's all you could build. That was buying a coin of the month in three years or five years. Let's just say that's the downside. Okay. What did you make in that period? You made $2,500, correct? 100 points times 25. So in that three years or five years, you made $2,500 in commissions. That's pretty powerful, right? Minimum. Okay, but here's the most powerful thing. Times 20 points for the coin of the month. I mean, you could use an extra $500 every month. <laughs> it's that simple. It's a great savings plan. So don't worry if you're the turtle or you're the tor rabbit. What do you call that thing? Tortoise. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Hair. So, see, that's the downside, but that's there's no downside there, is it? It's only an upside. So no reason to fear failure is my point here. No reason to fear failure because you won't. you got a whole bunch of teammates. You're going to learn. You can't help but learn how to do this business in two years if you allow yourself, give yourself the chance to succeed. And look at the real upside potential 
of what if. Now, what I mean by what if, the real upside potential. See, here's the key. You're going to end up, no matter what, you're going to end up with one leg that becomes stronger than the other, no matter what. One of them is going to blow out on you. Let's just say it's your left leg. You're going to end up with like 30,000 points or something like that in that leg. That means you got $30,000 up there waiting for you to draw out. And this leg is kind of poking along, poking along. This person plots it here, and this person plots it here. Something did this, and it, it went down way down here, down here. And, you know, you're pulling out 500 at a time, then it goes back to zero. But three years from now, not even on your driving leg over here, on your driving leg, three years from now, one person... Or a person over here comes and gets sponsored in three years from now. They're in Japan. We're just opening up in Japan. They were a Bob Reed or Dana Nelson. They took off. This becomes your huge big leg. This then comes 60,000 points over time. And now this one's down to zero because you got paid that $30,000 as that thing blew up. Hello! <laughs> you have... Do you have so many better odds of making that $7,000 a week by being part of this than ever winning the lottery if you played 100 tickets every week since you were born until you died and you still didn't win? <laughs> okay? Wow, what a powerful business this is. Just think about this. Just think about what I just said. <laughs> and it, you know, here's what I hear a lot from some people. Oh, I'm not in the main driving leg. It don't matter. Everybody's got a driving leg. Now, I'm going to end this by sharing you a couple things. The company is the best founded that I've ever seen in the network marketing industry. Got people of great character, integrity behind the company. But here's my warning to you. There are people in the network marketing industry, and I had them, I met a lot of them the first time in my gold business that I did. And I've met many throughout time as they prospected me into other businesses. There are a lot of disreputable people on the marketing side. Don't ever let them influence you or your decisions or what they do. You hold your head up high. You don't need, as Richard says, lie, cheat, or steal. To be in this business. But I earnestly mean that. You can have every bit of integrity. And if anybody in 7K out in the field. Ever approaches you. And encourages you. To change lines. I want you to report them in an email. To the company. And I want you to. Copy me on that email. No one should ever prospect you to join their business. You owe it to the person that brought you into this business, your allegiance, your, because you would have never known about the opportunity. You'd have never been given the chance to grow in it. If you hadn't had that person sponsor you. And then there's somebody up. If you're on the left of me or the right of me. And you're not in my driving leg. If you're like one of these kind of people on a side leg. I'm here to help you. No matter what. So anybody on the left or right of me as I look down. You can never with integrity say that I would not help you. Now, I won't bill your business for you, just like your sponsor should not bill your business for you. We help you 
build your business. But we don't do all the work for you because, you know, if you don't teach people how to fish, they're going to starve eventually. And if you think by going somewhere else that grass is greener, I'd tell the people who have people that sponsor people and they want to do that, you don't want them in your business anyway. Okay. Now, the only reason I'm giving you this warning is because I know the network marketing industry and there are people like that in the industry. And so I'm preparing you because we're going to have momentum growth. We're going to have growth. Because, see, if you get into a driving leg and you can't, you don't have the skills, attitudes, and techniques to build a leg, having that 30,000 points over there isn't going to do you a darn bit of good. You got to have somebody to teach you the skills, attitudes, and techniques, how to do it, how to go through, how to apply those seven P's of success that I just shared with you. Integrity makes the difference in the field along with a company. So, always be careful of somebody trying to sway you into doing something that's not quite honest. And that's stealing. They're trying to steal you to be in their business. Hmm. That's just a warning because hopefully that doesn't happen, but I know people, I know the network marketing industry, and I want to prepare you ahead of time, okay? Especially as we start having more and more meetings around the country, more and more people getting together, and you're in meetings and somebody starts talking to you about that, your best bet is to get their name and their card, turn around, walk off, and then report them. You, somebody in another line was prospecting you. That is not good. And that will hurt the business. And if you don't report, him, report them, I won't know about it. company won't know about it. And guess what? You're hurting our business. <laughs> okay? Because they can't be reprimanded or they can't be kind of say, hey, we don't do those things. There might be a lot of new people that join that don't know about that. Right? Right. Okay. So, it's a lot longer than I wanted to do, but I wrapped everything in a package for you to go over all the benefits, short-term, long-term, why a person needs to be joining the business, and hopefully this becomes your objection Tool to really be the last thing that you have to show somebody before they really understand what the opportunity is all about. Hope this works well for you.